North Korea is said to have hired 10 former Soviet KGB agents as military advisors to strengthen its capacity to protect leader Kim Jong-un against the risk of assassination from South Korea. About 10 former KGB agents were invited to Pyongyang in February and are now working in the North Korean counterintelligence unit, according to the Asahi Shimbun. Asahi Shimbun acquires this information from an unnamed living in the Korean capital. The former 10 elite spies are tasked with training bodyguards to protect Kim Jong-un. The bodyguard instructor who detects and responds to terrorist acts directed at the North Korean leader. The source said North Korean officials were particularly concerned about the deterrence of U.S. and South Korean assassinations using the latest weapons. One of the weapons that worried North Korean officials was the MQ-1C Grey Eagle unmanned attack aircraft UAV. The U.S. military is planning to bring the series to Korea in early 2018. The MQ-1C Grey Eagle is an improved version of the famous American military predator drone. Each Grey Eagle can carry four Hellfire missiles, attacking the ground from a distance of 8 kilometers. It is not clear to the former KGB agent how to protect Kim from the remote attack of U.S. unmanned aircraft. In addition, North Korea is also concerned about the U.S. plan to build an elite unit to carry out intelligence missions on its territory. Pyongyang wants ex-KGB agents to provide methods of tracking and exposing scouts to enhance their ability to protect leader Kim Jong-un. In May, North Korea accused the South Korean Intelligence Service NIS, of collaborating with the United States to plan to assassinate leader Kim Jong-un in 2014. NIS later made the statement, saying Kim Jong-un appeared less publicized for fear of being assassinated. The KGB was the famous Soviet intelligence agency, after the breakup of the Soviet Union. The KGB split into the Federal Security Service and the Foreign Intelligence Service of the Russian Federation.